It's all about her and the things that she does. me. It's all about you. Okay, okay, we're, we're recording, so. Oh, excellent. <laughs> And it's all about Juliana Pasha. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Devon Adoremi, WeWeBlogs.com. Three appearances at Festival of Kengis, mm -hmm. earning three top three finishes, yes, yes. including a victory spot in 2010. Yes, which I, uh, in, with which I was in Eurovision in the first place. Amazing. But, uh, I, but I have been uh, more than three times in in Festival Icangas. Oh, I yes. thought you did uh, like... Those were the three years where, when, I, third, when I was... Third, second, uh, yes, first. Yes, but I have been for uh, maybe uh, six or seven times. Wow. Competing in And you Festival won Icangas. Festival Magique. Yes, that year. After... I mean, after. <laughs> and you were the judge on Albanian X Factor. Yes. Is you are there right. any end to your talent? <laughs> and I was the judge in, in Kanga Magike in Best Absolutely. New Artist so for two years. Absolutely. Shall we stop there? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we said everything. So <laughs> So how's life now? Because apparently, when I was checking into my hotel, I heard that you also own a hotel. Yeah. Yes, you how's should come to mine. So <laughs> I have a boutique hotel, a small one. Uh, Has it got a restaurant? Yes, we have a restaurant. We when have am I uh, coffee <laughs> to, to, today if you want. <laughs> I, I'm going there now. So <laughs> uh, we have a small restaurant, a small coffee with a hotel. We, uh, we make, uh, uh, we do live music there because I love to sing in my home. So that is my home and that's why. And you love to dance. I saw you today yeah, yeah, with your yeah. steps I dance, I and, dance. you know, with the orchestra. <laughs> yes. It was so great. I love, I'm not a dancer, but I love to dance and I love to enjoy the music when I sing. So. so now looking at the Albanian music industry and seeing all the changes, I mean, you were a judge on X Factor. Mm -hmm. So as new talent emerges, what is it you look for in new talent? Um, I think now in Albania we have very lot new talents and uh, we are seeing this we, we have seen it this year in a Kanga Magica in fact uh, a lot of the new artists were in fact better than the big artists and I think that uh, if, a, if an artist is there uh, uh, express themselves and doesn't copy anyone it can be um, a great artist some, someday you have only to be yourself. You don't have to copy no one. You don't have to, to do the music uh, which someone else does. You have to do uh, uh, what you want and but, what, yeah, uh, what your desires are. But don't you think it's, it, we're <coughs> running out? Oh, God, we're losing you, Juliana. Oh, we definitely I'm here. need you I'm in the here. front. You be I'm here. here. <laughs> but don't you think that, we, um, that we're running out of ideas? Like there are not that many yes. original ideas but anymore. This, this is not only in Albania, it's in all over the world. Uh, we are uh, we are uh, listening music that uh, it's uh, identic or or uh, let me say somewhat identic with the uh, 16s the 60s 70s uh, for example Bruno Mars is uh, an example of uh, of uh, vintage, vintage kind of yes. new music just like uh, Stevie Wonder mm -hmm. and but I think it's it's something that he likes in Stevie Wonder and he wants to, to express it now, in our time. So are the new artists now. They hear something, uh, that someone they like, and uh, they want to, to make that, that little part of uh, uh, the, the, song, the singer that they like, they want to make it theirs. Uh, Is that what prompted you? I don't you? know if you understand me. <laughs> well, we do understand. Well, I, I think I do, because you, you had a little sort of um, detour into religious music for a while. Was that yes. to find a new expression? No, I, I still love religion music. I still love God. I still love Jesus. And, but I also love uh, my job. And my job is to sing, to sing everything that I like. And sing so, all kinds of music. <laughs> this is uh, something that God gave me, so I have to sing. Do you find that difficult to balance sometimes? Are there yes, times when you've difficult. refused certain certain um, projects because yes, you felt? Yes, I have refused certain lyrics, for example. 
which I didn't like. I didn't thought they they match me. They mm-hmm. match my beliefs or they match my character. It, it it doesn't have to be only my belief, but it has to be my character too. If it's something that I don't uh, like to sing, I don't sing it. And when you sing, do you sometimes imagine a different world or a different place? Because it's because looking at you on stage, <laughs> your expression is so livened and. It's almost like even when your back is turned to the orchestra, they can read yeah. what your moves are about. Maybe be. because uh, I have uh, more than, than 15 or 16 years singing live oh, with yes, a band. Honey. With a band, and maybe that's why I can, I can feel my orchestra. I can feel the musicians, and, and they can feel me. Because we communicate even if, if we don't see each other. But, uh, so you've worked with a lot of the crew that uh, are Some here of them, yes. Yeah, oh, yeah. Some of them, yeah. But uh, this is uh, this was a big orchestra, yeah. so uh, not like with 70, everybody. Yeah, yeah. Orchestra. It was uh, uh, the orchestra of theater and opera, and uh, and it was in celebration of tell us, tell us, tell mm-hmm. us. I want I want you to really be in the shot. Okay, <laughs> I am here. I'm still here. Don't worry. <laughs> uh, but uh, it's uh, it's true that when I when I sing, I imagine myself uh, in light, and that is why you see light. <laughs> And it's beautiful light. So what's Thank next you. for you in terms of your, um, <clears throat> your next moves? I'm, uh, I'm preparing to uh, release two new singles. Uh, maybe in uh, January okay. will be the first one. And uh, the other one will be in, in summer, in May or in... I, I don't know, maybe in May because it's my birthday. So you wait for it's May. It's also Eurovision. <laughs> May yes. is also Eurovision. I, when I was in Eurovision, uh, the in... second nine was my m- birthday, 20 May. Oh! And I celebrated my birthday there. Oh, with in everyone. Oslo? Yes, in oh, Oslo. Oh, <laughs> it was, that's it was a dream for me, so. <laughs> oh, fantastic. Do you have a message for your fans on Wubi Blogs? That, trust me, there's yes. loads of them. They're always yes, going, oh, is Juliana Pasha coming back to Eurovision? I said, you know what? She can tell you herself. <laughs> I don't know. I, in fact, I, I have loved that stage very much. And uh, I think it's, it's great for an artist to be there, uh, especially for an arti- artist from Albania to be in that stage. Uh, I don't know if I'm ever going, coming back, but um, maybe someday. But of course, that means you have to then do Festival of Kangas yes, again. <laughs> yes, but to do the Festival of Kangas, I have to have a very beautiful song. And I don't compete if I don't have a very beautiful song. What, are, what is your opinion on the, on the new changes, no orchestra and, well, at least for uh, one of the year, segments? No, I th- didn't like it. Last year, I didn't like it. Uh, if you have musicians in stage, you can, you can uh, express yourself better, you can sing better, you can communicate with them better. If you don't see uh, anyone uh, where, where the music comes, I'm sorry, but you don't know. I know. The, the, the only trouble with it is that you have songs that are seven minutes and then, then you now have to cut it and then there's a language yeah, this change. This is another problem. This is, yeah, a, this this is another problem, which uh, when I, when I compete, uh, compete uh, in, in 2010 in Festival Congress, It was in uh, Albania, Ardid, right? Ardid Jebrea, which was the composer, composer. of the song, uh, made the song three minutes just to be exactly like in Eurovision, and we Perfect. only redo, we only language redo, versions. yeah, language version or or uh, the orchestration, but uh, song was three minutes in Festival Congress, the only song, all the songs were five minutes, six minutes, four minutes. We were ours was only three minutes. And guess what? You won. Yeah, and I won. <laughs> and I hope that uh, Festival Congress makes the, this year all the songs three minutes. It's better. It's better for the show to hear only three minutes of music also it's and better, the concentrate. It's also better to compete with, with what, one another, yes. Yeah, also because the competition says three minutes, so why then have a song which is seven minutes, eight minutes long? I don't know. I, maybe, maybe it will change. I don't know. But I think something. Uh, a lot of fans of Eurovision likes this type of, uh, of strategy, let me say, of Albania, because they hear another thing in Festival Congress and then another thing in Eurovision. <laughs> and it's always something... Um, we, we make 
great changes of song. You and know it's that. such a gap as well, because yeah. Festival of Congress is usually the first to select. Yes. The year before the actual Eurovision, so it's a long stretch. Juliana, we love you on Wee Wee Blogs. Do you have a message you. for your fans? I love you all. I promise you, uh, if someday I'm going uh, again in Eurovision, I, I would like to meet you all, because uh, you have been a very important part for me in Eurovision. So uh, let me thank you with all my heart. And uh, bye. Eurovision News with Attitude, Miss Pasha here, honey. <laughs> See you later, guys. Bye. bye